And through this global pandemic, we've become accustomed to a lot of unknowns as research evolves slowly but surely. Two years into this, though, we have quite a few more answers for moms and moms-to-be who are especially concerned about protecting their little ones during this trying time. Research from the University of Idaho reveals the benefits of breastfeeding for moms who were infected or vaccinated. It was a huge question mark. It was an international crisis. Um, and in fact, the first recommendations that came out from some authoritative bodies was that women should not breastfeed. The first unknown and great concern was if a COVID positive mom could pass on the virus to her baby through breast milk. We've now done really intensive studies that can show that, in fact, in this case, in COVID, that virus is not passed from mom to baby during breastfeeding, which is very reassuring. One of the big things that um, moms have, though, that no one else has is the ability to pass on immunity. Dr. Parker is a pediatrician at Kootenai Health, and she gave birth to her third child just before lockdown. I pulled my other two out of daycare, and I said, we are not leaving the house because I have no idea how this is going to affect the baby. Two years later, it's a much different story. Moms who breastfeed their babies who again have had a recent COVID infection within the past few months um, or who have had their vaccines are able to pass on antibodies through the breast milk. Results from the local research even support recommendations that women who are lactating continue breastfeeding during and after COVID infection. It's just suggested that they use the same precautions everybody else does, that they wear a mask, that they wash their hands, etc. But they can do that safely and breastfeed. Once COVID hit, leading this was a no-brainer for McGuire. And when you're a breastfeeding researcher and you know that this is going to be an international health crisis, you jump in and, and you do the science that needs to get done. So it was, you know, it was a labor of love for all of us that worked on it. She admits it was far and away the most difficult research she has ever done, but well worth it. Very, very gratifying research to do in the end. To be clear, while infection and vaccinations can transfer antibodies through breast milk to the baby, catching the virus is significantly more risky during pregnancy than getting vaccinated during pregnancy. So the advice remains the same, get vaccinated.